Sarah Burke here with Mikey Anderson, uh, team captain for Team USA. How's practice this morning? It was good. Good. Yeah. Touched on a couple of things. Uh, look forward to tonight and um, just uh, got out there, got a little movement. Now, coming back so many years in a row, uh, what is it that you're working on in this tournament this year specifically? I mean, I, I think just to keep, you know, continue growing my game. Um, obviously, coming back this year more as a leader, um, kind of bring more of a leadership role, can work on, on some of those things. But, um, you know, I feel more confident this year just having gone through it once. Um, I mean, I, I knew our team was going to be fine with uh, whoever whoever was wearing this C. I mean, we got five guys, including myself, back from last year's team. Um, you know, I, yeah. we all have trust in each other, and I was the one that was uh, fortunate enough to be named captain. But, um, you know, the other four guys, they're doing just yeah. as much as I am uh, to be to lead this team. So if you were going to be giving advice to uh, a younger player, maybe who's going to play his first year in World Juniors, what would that advice be? I mean, right, right away just to enjoy it because you don't know if you're going to get to do it again. Um, you know, it, it can be a once-in-a-lifetime thing, and it's something everyone here dreams about playing in as a kid. So, um, you know, first off, it's to enjoy it. but uh, And then at the same time, it's, you know, how serious this, this really is. Um, it, it goes by quick once you're in it, so it's, mm -hmm. it's something you don't want to have a lot of learning experiences. Something goes around, you got to learn from it quick, and you got to keep moving forward. Now, maybe it's a player from the Kings, maybe it's a different player, uh, but who did you look up to in the NHL growing up? Uh, when I was little, me and my brother always liked Marion Gabrick. He was uh, played for the Wild, and he was always scoring goals. So I just remember uh, being little kids, we both had a Gabrick jersey running around the house nice. pretending we were him. So, you know, your brother also has uh, a lot of the same experiences as you, and you both being a, a team captain for Team USA is a very cool thing. Have you learned anything specifically from your brother on this? I mean, ju just being with him all the time, and he knows me better than anyone else, but uh, just kind of his work ethic and, and his uh, mental approach every day coming to the rink. Um, you know, he's, he's a true leader in that aspect. It's something you, you can't teach anyone to really have. So, I mean, I, just, just watching him throughout the years, um, seeing how he carries himself, um, I try to, you know, accumulate all, all the little things yeah. he does and bring that into my game. Um, I mean, even though we're, we're two completely different people, um, you know, we have a lot of the same characteristics at the rink. Yeah. Uh, what is uh, the silliest fight you and your brother have ever had, whether it's hockey related or not? <laughs> Uh, silliest fights probably we got we got into it at my sister's uh, graduation party when she graduated from high school we were playing a game of stain pond running around a ping pond table and I got him out and the the paddle started getting thrown and we, we put on a pretty big scene in front of a lot of people um, luckily my sister wasn't mad about it so I was thank, thankful for her on that one and uh, last but not least uh, what about the best piece of advice that's ever been given to you um, I'd probably say for my dad just Growing up, he never forced uh, me to play the game. It was always, um, you know, if you're having fun with it, keep going. Um, you know, it never was forcing me to go to the rink. It was, it got to the point where, you know, he gave us the opportunities. He would bring us there. He would give us everything we need. But um, his big thing was just always making sure we had fun. If we weren't having fun, um, you know, it, it's, it's what it's all about. So at yeah. the end of the day, if you're not having fun with it, it's... Uh, it's, you're doing yourself a disservice because it's a fun game. Yeah. Is Dad here to watch? Yep, Dad, Mom, and uh, my sister's here as well. Nice. Well, enjoy the tournament, uh, like you said, and uh, good luck towards the medal. Thank you very much.